really thought melanin was just a pigment, huh? Just a little extra brown sugar on the skin. Nothing major, nothing divine. You were pushed, pimped, and programmed to believe that your melanin meant nothing. Meanwhile, they've been studying it, replicating it, and harvesting it for centuries. They convinced you and the world they don't want to be like you. Yet they inject their lips, tan their skin, perm their hair, and steal your DNA for medical breakthroughs. Let's be real. If melanin was so useless, why are they cloning it in labs? Why are they conducting studies on its energy absorption and radiation protection and neurological advantages? Be sure. Tell me again how you're inferior. They told you all men were created equal, but did they mean you? Funny because the same ones preaching equality were the same ones who called you three-fifths of a human told you your brain was smaller while secretly documenting your genius. Built an entire medical industry off your literal cells. If we're all the same, explain this. Why does melanin absorb and convert sunlight into energy? Why does it protect against radiation? And wow, others burn under the same sun. Why do scientists use melanin to develop bioelectronic devices, solar panels, and radiation shields? Sounds more like a superpower than a skin tone, doesn't it? But they couldn't let you know that. They had to convince you that your power was a curse, not a gift. And the best way to do that is to rewrite history. They say melanin is just a pigment, nothing more, nothing special. Oh really, that's cute. So explain this, if melanin is so insignificant, then why is it at the core of so much scientific discovery? But let's start with the basics. Melanin is a biological superconductor. It absorbs and transforms energy like chlorophyll in plants. Melanin protects the DNA and it shields against UV damage preventing mutations and cancer. Melanin stores and release energy and scientists have found it to convert sunlight and even radiation into usable biochemical energy. In other words, melanin is alive and it's intelligent. But don't just take my word for it. Let's talk about those scientific receipts. What about Chernobyl? Well, did you know melanin containing fungi were thriving in the ruins of Chernobyl? While radiation was destroying everything else, these fungi absorbed it, converted it into energy and kept growing. That's right, melanin can absorb radiation and turn it into power. Who would have thought that? 